again, quick turnaround uh, for us uh, after the game in Missouri uh, last night. Challenging game offensively. Uh, did Certainly didn't have the flow and execute at the level uh, that we needed to. Uh, even at the free throw line, as consistent as we've been in top three in free throw shooting, going 13-23 uh, to 23 from the line last night. Not characteristic uh, of the team. And then on the defensive end, uh, we weren't as good or as we needed to be, especially trying to cover the three-point line going in. Scouting report for me uh, with the uh, danger there and did not do a great job after getting a lead uh, against them there in the uh, uh, first half uh, as well in there even in the uh, second half. But with a quick turnaround against a very tough, talented Georgia team, a lot of starters back. Uh, from last year, uh, probably one of the most physical teams um, in our conference, certainly presented a great challenge uh, for us uh, tomorrow, uh, and uh, we certainly need to be ready uh, to be at our best and play much better uh, than we performed on last night. How do you keep shooters confident after a night like that, both from the field and the free throw line? Uh, good shooters are able to uh, bounce back. Uh, Repetition and you know, working and practice, and if you play enough games, you know you're going to have some of those nights. But uh, you just have to remain positive. Understand that uh, maybe if you're taking good shots, feet set, good looks at the basket, uh, that you're confident. If it was rush shots or uh, shots that you don't normally take, then you just want to make sure that you remove those and, and, and take those away, so you can certainly get back to shooting the higher percentage shots that you shoot. So as long as we're shooting high percentage shots, getting the looks of the basket, uh, I think we'll be fine.